Hello everyone, this is Animation World. Welcome back to some more old school RuneScape. Last time, we went incognito mode, invaded the Black Knight's fortress, and then brewed some magical potion that tasted like rat tail and burnt meat. Today, we are on the port, the fishing port, if you couldn't tell. And we are here with Redbeard Frank, which, who apparently has a quest for us. Arr, matey. Arr. 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 You pirates are sophisticated folk. Arr. I'm in search of treasure. Arr, treasure you be after, eh? Might be able to tell you where to find some. For a price. What sort of price? Well, for example, if you can get me a bottle of rum. No, just any rum in mind. I like some one made on Karajma Island. Karam Karamja Island. There's no rum like Karamja rum. Okay. I can do that. You're a saint, although it take a miracle to get out of Karamja. Why is that? Custom officer's been clamping down on the export of spirits. He seemed like a resourceful young lad. I'm sure he'll be able to find a way to slip stuff past him. This is illegal. You tell me to break the law? I'm fine with that. So, we gotta get this guy some rum, and those look like they'll take me to Entrana. Uh, Seaman Loris. No, I'll talk to Captain Tobias. You wanna go on a trip to Karamja? Oh, uh, that's expensive, but sure. Karamja. Here we go. It's this big island right here. It looks like kind of like kind of like an onion, a weirdly shaped onion. Hello, how's it going? How can I help you? Uh, you want to trade? You have nothing I want to get rid of. Okay, that's fine. Aha, here we go. Zembo. Hello, Zembo. You have an interesting shirt. Hey, I want to try some of my fine wines and spirits. All brew locally on Kramja Island. Ah, uh, sure. Yeah, some beer, some Kramja one, and some drink. I think this is what I need. Cool beans. <laughs> um, I got it. So, can I go now? You're not putting your hands on my things. Okay, let's see what they say about about customs. I'm not that sort of customs officer. Okay, who can I see about that? Who do you report to? Why do you have to search me? Because Asgarnia has banned the import of intoxicating spirits. Uh, sure. Let's go, mom. It's your personal use. You... You took it? That's stealing. Uh, let's go see about the other guy. Let's go, let's go see if the other guys know anything about the, um, the customs. Because obviously that person knows nothing. Uh, where's the captain? Captain Tobias, hello. You don't have anything you want to tell me. Okay, so I guess we gotta figure this out ourselves using our mad detective skills. So I talked to the man, he didn't help me at all. Yes, he does. I'm in search of a quest. Can't help me there? Oh. You're not very exciting. Luthius. Is that a monkey? You got a monkey on your shoulder. I want one. What's on his back? I want one. Can I have can I have your monkey? That I'm with I'm in the map page here. Yeah, the custom office is annoying. Well I know it pretty well. She doesn't cause me any trouble anymore. She even searched my expert of crates anymore. She knows they only continue. Oh. Really? How interesting. Whereabouts do you send these to? There's a little oak shop in Port Sirem that buys them up by the crate. I believe it's run by a man called Wyden. Interesting. She doesn't check them. Loopholes. Can I work for you? Um, 
Yes, I can sort something out. There's a crate ready to be loaded onto the ship. You would believe the demand for bananas from Maiden Shop over at Putsayam. I think the third crate I've shipped in this month. You can fill up with bananas, I'd pay you 30 gold. Okay, what crate? This, oh, this crate? This crate right here? That looks like his personal crate. This one? Crate is completely empty. How many bananas do I need? And I also... Uh, I'll, I'll, just, I'll just see what happens when I fill up with bananas. To the banana picking. All the bananas. Here we go. I got ten whole bananas. Okay, it's full of bananas. Really? It just takes ten? Cool beans. Do you pay me for another crate full? Yeah. Go outside to see the old crate has been loaded onto the ship. There's empty crates. Wow, they did like magic. Anything else? No. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to go over here. We're going to trade with Zumbo. We're going to get some rum. We're going to go up and search the banana trees. We're going to pick some more bananas. Oh, there's no bananas on that tree. Some more of these. I need one more. I need, I need this one. I need one more banana and all those trees are empty. I need to go faster. I need to set to walk over there. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. We have 10 bananas we got to place in this thing. I'm going to put it right in the middle. I'm going to fill the crate. So... So there's five bananas. I'm going to put the rum in the crate. And I'm going to do that right, right on top. If we search it, crate is full of bananas. There's also mum stash to two. Nice. We are so secret. This isn't legal at all. Look at bananas. Cool. So, um,. Where are they being delivered to again, just so I know? Wilden and Port Simon. Okay, that's where we gotta get to. Back to the port. And there we go, we have arrived. So we are looking for the grocery store. Could be this. Wildin, yeah, there we go. It's that simple. So. Hi. I heard you got a shipment of bananas. I need that shipment of bananas. Why isn't that in your stock? Two two whole gold coins for bananas? He paid me 30 for a crate full. You are not selling them at a high enough price. I'll tell you that. Uh, what can you recommend? <laughs> we have a, this really exotic fruit all the way from Karamja. It's called a banana. Oh, whoa. <laughs> okay. Um... Can I just go back here? Okay, so only employees. Can I get a job here then? You're keen, I'll give you that. <laughs> I'm so keen. I, I just walk in your store, go to the back door, and say, hey, can I get a job? I just realized there's no music playing. Um, I'll give you that. Okay, I'll give you a go. Have you got your own white apron? No, I haven't. We can't work here unless you have a white apron. Health and safety regulations. Well, where can I get one? On my own That's a far way away. I'm sure that I've seen a spare of at Gertz Fish or somewhere. Okay, that, that's 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 a bit closer. I've actually been to the fish this fish store quite a lot. This is where I go to sell all the stuff. Like, hey, there we go. This is where I go to sell my fish. That's how I get my money. The fisherman, you see. This guy right here, Durant. Yeah, he's he's like my he's my contact. My contact on the port. I go f catch all the fish. And, I, you know, I just sell it to him, and he buys it for lots of money. Okay, I have a white apron now. I'm ready to handle food. I don't need gloves or anything. Wow, you are prepared. You're hired. Go to the back, hurry up. Okay. <laughs> Apparently it's that easy. Just walk into a, a grocery store wearing a white apron, and you can get hired and trusted doing the back stuff. 
A lot of potatoes in there. Let's take some potatoes. You know, then we can sell it back to him. Yeah. Them cool strats. Cabbage. Yes, I'll take some cabbage. All the cabbage. We got here. There's nothing in there. What about the sacks? The dentistry sacks. Ooh, this looks like where the bananas are held. A lot of bananas in the crate. Oh, there's, there's the bottle. Magic bottle. Let's also take a banana. What's in these crates? More chicken. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. More chicken is pretty good. Just take all the raw chicken. There's a teddy around back there now? <laughs> yeah, you gonna pay me? Uh, no. <laughs> well, you're a jerk. Okay. Sorry, you're not... You'll just take it back from me. Oh, there we go. I got the banana. I got, I got points for the banana. Okay, we can now go back to... What was his name? Pirate something? I don't need this anymore. Who needs sanitation? We're gonna go back and we're gonna give him his his, his treasure. And he's gonna give us ours. Wahaha. Arr, matey. We bought some mum for your old mate Frank. Yeah, got it. Now, deal's the deal. I'll tell you about a treasure. I serve under a pirate captain called One-Eyed Hector. Hector was very successful and became very rich. What, what is, voice is this? But about a year ago, we were boarded by customs and excise agents. What voice is that? I can't figure out this guy's voice now. Hector were killed along with many a crew. I only a few. I I were only of the few escaped and escaped with this. I protect some hands your key. This be Hector's key. I believe it opens his chest in the old room in the Blue Moon Inn of Rock. The luckiest treasure will be in there. Okay. Cool. I can teleport there. Bye. So the Blue Moon Inn, the place where we toast to our victories, apparently is the home of some great treasure. We gotta find this one-eyed Hector's chest. This one-eyed chest, you could say. Is it on the bottom floor? It's the cook. Upstairs, maybe. It's an inn, so he stores the room upstairs. There's a chest there. That's just a man. That's just a man. This room. Oh, that looks like a chest. That also looks like a chest, but more of a drawer's chest. In here? Ooh. All that's in the chest is a message. Visit the city of the White Knights in the park Saradome and points to the X which marks the spot. A riddle wrapped in a mystery, wrapped in a chest at the Blue Moon Inn. City of the White Knights. We were ju we just saw the White Knights. Those that was Falador in the park. Okay, so let's go to Falador and let's go to the park. Okay, back to good old Faliator. Go to the park. We've been here before. We saw. A um, Wizen, whatever his name is, the farmer. Now in the park, uh, in the park, Saradom points to the extra smudge the spot. Saradomen points. Those are flowers. Oh, right here. Maybe a shovel. And I happen to know there's a shovel right here. A speed. And the door is gonna block me to getting it. We're good. Let's see if it's right here. Treasure. Ah! You're being attacked by a gardener. You gotta die now whole level 4 gardener. Died. Let me dig up my treasure. Dig a hole in the ground. And find a little chest of treasure. Two quest points. One eye Hector's treasure chest. You can also use the pay to fare option to go to him from Karajma. It's in here. Whoa. 
A ring and an emerald. So fancy. So here's a place we haven't seen too often. This is a uh, Kyrid. I think we stopped here to buy some pants or something. So, in the big castle, the big palace, there's a quest that calls for our need. I believe Hassan has it for us. That's a nice chair about this. All these chairs. Greetings, I am Hassan, Chancellor of the em Chancellor to the Emir of Al Qaeda. Can I help you? You must need some kind of help in the desert. I mean, the desert is a dangerous place. I need the service of someone, yes. If you're interested, see this by Master Osman. Make the finances here. Come to me and you need payment. That's it? Okay. I have seen this guy. He's like right outside. By that red star. Osman. The Chancellor trusts me. <laughs> he trusts me so much. We had a 30 second conversation. Now he trusts me in the world. I have come for instructions. My prince is captured by the Lady Kelly. Kelly? We need to make the rescue. There are two things we need you to do. That's the first thing. Start with one. This is guarded by some stupid guards and a clever woman. The woman is our only way to get the prince out. Only she can walk freely about the area. I think we need to tie her up. One coil of rope should do that. Then disguise the princess as her to get her out without suspicion. Um, how good must the guys be? Only we'll at full regards of distance. You know, a skirt like hers, same color, same style. We only have a short time. But a blonde wig too, that is up to make or find. We need to color the skin of the prince. My daughter and top spy Leia. Leila can help you. She has sent word that she has discovered where they are keeping the prince. It's near Draina Village. She's looking somewhere near there now. It's the second thing. You said there were two. We need the key. We need a copy made. If you can get some soft clay, then you can copy the key. If it's Lady Kelly to show it to you for a moment, she's very boastful. It should not be too hard. Bring the infant to me with a bar of bronze. Okay. So it's collection time. I actually have a bunch of stuff. For that specific that requirements um, I don't think I need this pirate message anymore um, yeah yeah I don't think I need this pirate message anymore we'll just get rid of that throw this in here do I have one of these I do I thought I didn't let's see what we got Bar of bonds. Uh, no rope. There's a place you can get rope and drainer. I know that for a semi fact. Let's take this. Put that here, I think. Why is Limper Root marking this stuff? Emerald. Um. There you go. Got it. Uh, bar of bronze. I don't have rope. What else did I need? That's it. Now I gotta walk to Drainer. Or I can... Cannot teleport. <laughs> okay, I, I got some walking to do. So we know this place. This is Drainer Village. Right over here is the place I always get attacked by these jail guards. I'm gonna assume there's some kind of jail over here. There's Lady Kelly. There's guards. Wish to enter. Hello. Lady Kelly. Yeah, that's me. Hi, I heard you have someone in your prison. Yeah, there it is. Prince Ali. Fabulous he. Ali Ababwa. So apparently, there's someone around here we need to see. Leia. Leia. Lila, I'm here to help you free the prince. Your employment is known to me. Now you know all that we need to make a the break. I must make a disguise. What do you suggest? Only Lady Kelly can wander outside the jail. The guards will shoot to kill if they see the prince out, so we need a disguise good enough to fool them at a distance. We need a wig we made from wool. If you find someone who can work with wool, ask them about it. There's witch nearby that may be able to help you dye it. I'd seen that witch before. You will need to get a pink skirt, same as Kelly's. Uh, we still need something to color the prince's skin lighter. There's a witch close to here. She knows about many things. You may know some way to make the skin lighter. You will need some rope to tie up Kelly, of course. I heard there's a good rope maker around here. What can I do with the guards? 
Most of the guards will be easy. The skies will get past him. The only guard will be a problem with the one at the door. We can discuss this more when you have the rest of the escape kit. Okay. So, apparently, there's a rope mic around here. And I know there is, because he's right here. Hello. Can I trade you? Ah, oh, check it out. The rope. It's that simple. It's that simple. So, we've talked to the witch before about making dye. So let's see if she knows anything about other stuff. Do you think of a way to make skin paste? Why, it's one of my most popular potions. The women here, they have smooth looking skin, I must admit. Some of the men buy it as well. Wait for you, just get me what's needed. What do you need? Well, dear, you need a base for the paste. That's a mix of ash, flour, and water. Then you need red berries, the color as you want. Bring me those four items and make you some. So, uh, ash, flour, and water. Okay. Okay, I can do that. Um. What else was there? Uh, so they color the skins and a wig. This guy was good with rope. I wonder if he's good at making wigs. Like you know, you just you just weave. I wonder if you do that. Um, make other things. You thinking of? Could you give me a sweater? Or some sort of wig. Well, that's an interesting thought. Yes, I think I could do something. Give me three balls of wool and maybe to do that. I'll get some. I will go get you three balls of wool. Eventually. Uh, right now, what do we need? Okay, the key, we need a clay, and I know there's clay in the mines south, east, south, yes, southwest of the rock. I, that's where I've gotten it before. The skin is going to require red berries, which is south of rock. The skirt, I'm pretty sure we can get into rock. I am going to trek up there, because I can't teleport because I'm out of runes. And, you know, just do a bit of shopping real quick. Okay. Stop one. The mines. Where we get some clay. This is clay, right? This is clay. Stop two. The center of rock to the clothing store. I believe... Yes, we can get a pink skirt. I believe that's where I got my cape. That same store. They have some good stuff there. Go check it out today. They're the Reese's clothing store. Yeah. And stop three. The red berry bushes we know and love and probably should take more from when we're here so you don't have to come back so often. And two logs. What does it mean? Can I home teleport now? Eight more minutes. Anything else I need here? I could get the ashes in the water, I suppose. That's pretty simple. That'll work for getting ashes. Uh, pick them up. I was gonna burn for some some logs or something. I suppose this is a lot easier. Just kill an imp. Yeah. So we got the soft clay. We got clay. But we gotta make soft clay. So just get a bucket of water. Use that. So we have that, 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 and what else? What other weird thing was required for the skin paste? It doesn't want to tell me. Okay. Red berries, ashes, water. I can't remember. Yep. Good to teleport home where the last ingredient was flour. Yes, that is the mystical last ingredient. And all these two things, we need that, we need three pieces of wool. We can get just north of here. Uh, so I'm going to head and do that. Something else I need to get really quick right inside this house is the end of the episode. So, thanks for watching. We're going to have to pick this up next time where we go rescue Prince Ali, fabulous he, from the clutches of some other person. I don't remember their name. The name wasn't significant enough for me to remember. And uh, Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.